Hi friends, today we will watch a very popular classical Greek play, Oedipus, the King of Thebes, written by Sophocles. Sophocles, was one of the most famous and celebrated writers of the golden era of Greece. His famous tragic dramas are, Oedipus, Antigonia and the Women of Trachis. His plays provide an invaluable insight about the social and political aspects of ancient Greece. Oedipus is the second of Sophocles' three Theban plays. The city of Thebes was founded by a man named Cadmus. Oedipus, the play was first performed in 429 BC. Thebes is suffering from plague, which leaves its field and women, barren. Oedipus, the king of Thebes has sent his brother-in-law, Creon, to the house of Apollo to ask the oracle the reason and remedy. The blind prophet Tiresias was also called in. Young sons and daughters of Cadmus, you look so pale full of pain and grief. Do tell your king Oedipus. I have already sent Creon to know the reason behind your tears. Oh here comes my friend Creon. What news you bring for us, my dear brother-in-law? My lord, the Delphi at Apollo has warned to find and punish the murderer of King Laius, whose wife Jocasta was married to you. When you answered the Sphinx and was crowned. My dear Oedipus, here comes the old and blind prophet, Tiresias. Tiresias, you are well versed in everything, of the earth and heaven, you have no eyes but you know all, you alone can rescue us, help us knowing the murderer of our king Laius. Alas, how terrible is the wisdom, when it brings no profit, to the man who is wise, ah, oh, why did I come here, I knew this already. You rob us from your gift of prophecy. You care not for the law and the country. For God's sake let us know if you know anything. Would you betray us and destroy the city? Tell us. I will speak against my will. If you insist, you are the murderer of the king. Whose murderer you seek, I will not ruin your fate. Apollo is enough. I am no slave of yours. The flashback, when Oedipus was born there was a prophecy from the oracle of Delphi. The baby would bring misfortune to the kingdom, he would accidentally murder his own father. And would marry his own mother, the king and the queen were devastated. The king ordered the servants to kill the infant, but the servants had no heart for the crime. The infant was left by the shivants at a lonely spot, from where it was picked up by the shepherd, who gave the baby boy to the childless king, Polybus of Corinth. Thank you shepherd, he will be our son, the son of Polybus, the prince of Corinth, we both shall love you as our very own son. God is gracious. Oh I am damned. The people say that I will bring misfortune to my parents. What should I do? Oh Apollo, I am a curse to them, before I leave in the middle of the night and go away. Now frustrated Oedipus, indulges in drinking with his friends, once when he was quite drunk he saw some travelers passing by. He got himself in a brawl with the group and their leader. Oedipus is not in his senses, he is drunk and angry, kills the leader of the troop, and from there on's away feeling victorious, unknowingly he killed his father, King Laius. Oedipus came upon a kingless land, the Sphinx was there to ask some riddles to the stranger entering the kingdom, Oedipus answered all the riddles correctly and became the king.
as per the custom of that kingdom, the new king was supposed to marry the widow of the dead king, Oedipus marries Jocasta, the widow of King Laius, he then takes over the crown. When the truth becomes open to Jocasta that Oedipus is his long lost son, she commits suicide out of guilt, and Oedipus takes two pins and plunges them in his eyes. Thus the prophecy becomes true. The oracle had predicted that Oedipus will kill his own father and marry his own mother, in spite all his efforts to save himself from the disaster, Oedipus could not change his fate, thus. Count no man happy, until he is dead, free from all his pains. Sophocles make a good use of dramatic irony, at the start of the play people come to him to free them from the curse, he himself was a curse, he himself did the crime unknowingly. Hope you like the classical Greek play. Log in www.miraclewebstore.com, visit at Miracle, the best institute of literature, by friends, see you soon.